Oh, hey there. Now look, a lot of times people think, especially keyboard warriors these days, they're like, I have anonymity. I'm behind this keyboard and nobody can touch me. And that's a dumb move. When I was 17, we, I, I bought this camper. It's called a Mirage. And, uh, and it had a CB radio in it. And we did not understand CB radios. And so we drove from North Carolina to Washington State and we thought we'd have fun with the CB radio because we didn't realize it was a relatively short range. We thought this just went on forever and we were talking to anybody on the planet Earth. And that was a mistake on our part. It was only maybe a couple miles tops. And so we're talking all this nonsense, talking all this trash to these truckers. And real quick, they're like, I think it's that little Mirage over there. And we're all like, how do they know who we are? Because it's got that big CB antenna on top of it. And they look and they, it's not one of us, we're all professionals. It's those clowns right there. Now, today, praise God, I sold a house. One of my four that I'm trying to sell. And I'm very grateful for that. Now, I want to tell you that the buyers put me through it. They squeezed me everywhere that they could squeeze me. And their broker, their agent, also squeezed me as much as possible. And I told my realtor once the whole deal was done, I was like, I know that they represented their buyer and they did everything that their buyer asked. And they squeezed me for every penny and they just really ran me through it. Congratulations, you won one time. You can shear sheep a lot of times, you can only skin them once. I will remember your name. I will never use you for business ever again. What you did was bad business to me. The way that you treated me was bad business. I see you, I know your name, I will remember you. And I think this is a good lesson in life because oftentimes we think, I'll just tell them how it is. You're like, you probably ought to keep your mouth shut. You probably ought to not push somebody to their limit because they will remember you forever, good or bad. If there's somebody that helps me in the least, I remember that forever you have my loyalty. If somebody does me dirty, I also remember that. Now look, I forgive, I overlook things, but I'm just saying I'm one of the nice ones and not everybody does that. So maybe think about how you treat people because it does matter.